Hey friends, come hang out with me as I get lots of things done over the few days in today's video. I hope this video gives you the motivation that you need to tackle those busy Monday day-to-day -day tasks on your to-do list. You had me at a Where you go is where I go. So today was a busy day for us. We are currently on spring break when I'm filming this and every day of this week I try to go out with the kids and do something fun with them and this means all the house chores were put on hold. So today I am finally getting around to cleaning and tackling my to-do list. We can leave and run away someday. Today we are starting off in the kitchen which was a mess but this is a real life and you guys know I keep it real. I don't do any pre-cleaning before I start any actual cleaning. You guys see how it really is and if you have been following along and you are new here, welcome. My name is Galena. I am a wife and a mom to three little ones ages 6, 3, and 1 on my channel you will find tons of real life cleaning motivation I upload a new video every Monday so be sure to subscribe to my channel by clicking the red button down below it is free to you and it helps out my channel a lot I can take you anywhere somewhere we won't be scared So I think my number one question that I get a ton is why I don't have a dishwasher and the answer is very simple. I don't have one. When we moved into this house which was about six years ago, we it was just me and my husband and I really didn't see the need for one. I always washed the dishes by hand even when I lived with my parents it's something that I just got used to and honestly I don't mind it but if we do move into our next home I'm definitely getting a dishwasher just because we have so many more dishes that we go through and a dishwasher would be helpful and time-saving for sure so now I am going to move on to our dining room and clean off the table and you guys might see Adeline walking throughout this video she was awake while I was getting my cleaning done I try to clean while she naps but sometimes it just doesn't work out that way and you just got to do what you got to do so you might see her walking around but I actually wanted to wash our chair covers today you guys our chairs are leather and they have served us for a very long time and with kids they just got destroyed the leather started to peel and I'm not quite ready to purchase a new dining set so I wanted to wait while we move into our next home to do that and in meantime I just got these chair covers off Amazon and they have been really great I just like to wash them from time to time just to get them nice and clean again and then I see you on the streets and your heart just skipped a beat you miss me it's always the same story with you but i just cannot refuse you i'm sad after this and i don't know how you leave me with this rush why am i so curious so curious so curious Your friend 
So now going back into the kitchen, I am putting away all the dishes so I can wipe down the countertops and clean my sink. But I was just curious, do you guys have a cleaning schedule where you clean on specific days of the week or do you guys just clean a little bit every day? Comment down below and let me know. I'm very curious, especially if you have little ones. For me, uh, even if I try to plan anything, it usually never goes that way. So for me, I just kind of clean as I go. I would love to have a cleaning schedule, maybe sometime in the future. But for now, I just honestly clean on the days when I have free time. But definitely comment down below and let me know how it is for you. Do you clean on specific days of the week or is it just kind of um, whenever you have time a little bit every day just like for me so comment down below I would love to read your responses and I will be using my favorite vacuum and mop. This is the S3 vacuum and mop all in one. You can get this off Amazon. It is worth every penny in my opinion. I use it almost every single day. It saves me so much time, especially if you have little ones. I clean my floors like every single day just because they get so dirty. And with this thing, it just vacuums mops everything in one so convenient so easy to use and it saves time
quickly wanted to stop mopping my floors and clean these picture frames just because it's been a minute since I have cleaned them. It's one of those things that I just walk by and just kind of forget that they're even there. But I definitely wanted to wipe them down. It's been a while and I am going to continue mopping the floors in the kitchen, which in my last video I shared with you guys how I cleaned my kitchen tile grout and ever since I cleaned it you guys it has made such a big difference I highly recommend putting it on your spring cleaning to-do list it will make such a big uh, difference in your space so if you guys want to find out what products I use definitely check out my previous clean with me video Right, guys so it is the next day I am filming this kind of late like I said we are on spring break and I like to take my kids out and do something fun with them so we were busy this morning doing that and when I started cleaning this it was already like past I don't even know what time I started but it was getting already pretty late um, but I still wanted to do some cleaning I wanted to wash our bed sheets it's been a minute since I have washed them I usually like to wash them once a week let me know how often you guys wash your bed sheets I also had some towels that were done drying I think they've been sitting there for a few days like I said I have been behind on cleaning so I'm trying to catch up and just get my house back in order Now moving on to the bathroom, I'm going to do a little bit of a deep cleaning in here. But first I'm going to clean off the vanities, take the dirty towels down and throw those into the wash. And I really want to organize these vanities. We are running out of space. They're getting a little cluttered. So I really need to find some time and organize them. But for now we are just going to focus on deep cleaning the sinks.
So now that the bathroom is all done, I'm going to go ahead and finish making my bed. The bed sheets just finished drying as well, so I will be putting those back on and making my bed. I also wanted to vacuum in here, so I will be doing that as well. And then we are going to go downstairs and finish cleaning the living space. So this morning we played in the living room for a little bit so I have some toys that I need to clean up and take back to the playroom. I'm also going to fold the towels that have been sitting there all day so I have a little bit of cleaning to do in here and just tidying up the space. Throw your stuff away before you make up your mind that I'm nowhere to find I'm standing right here I know that I told you we're over I swear that I'm sober Just listen, I miss you And I know that I said all these things But now when you're with her I can see that That you miss Me 
to finish off today's cleaning, I'm going to wipe down these picture frames. My kids love touching them, so they get tons of little fingerprints on them, so I like to wipe them down once in a while. This is going to be it for today's clean with me. Hopefully this video was motivating to you and you were able to get some things done off your to-do list. If you want to see more of my behind the scene, mom life, motherhood life, follow me on my Instagram page and I will see you guys all back in my next video.